Greetings friends, it's Thursday afternoon and the turbine's been running brilliantly and I think the reason is because I've got that battered old solar panel connected. Even now it's keeping the batteries at 26 volts and allowing the turbine to get up to speed without having to struggle too much. So I recommend if you've got a wind turbine and you can connect a solar panel to the system then that will allow the wind turbine to spin up to speed easier and start making power. This is the beat up solar panel that I'm using. I will have to invest in a uh, proper one sometime. So here we can see the solar panels making about 10 watts. I'm just gonna wait and see if the wind kicks up. In other very good news, I've actually received a brand new rectifier from Amazon, which is very nice indeed, and which I already have installed. Okay, so this has been replaced. What was happening, I was using the spin bike and the brake kept coming on constantly. So now we have the wind turbine rectifier here. We've got the solar panel coming in here. We've got everything connected to that. And we've got that rectifier for the spin bike. Solar panels put in four watts. Okay, so we've got the three kilowatt bike motor hooked up. And I'm just gonna show you what that can do. Not actually that much. Let's wait till we get a bit of wind and I'll give it a, I'll give it a pedal. Go on the wind. Here we go. I'm going to pedal for a minute, try and get the voltage up. Come on, we need some wind. It's not looking good. Just to prove a point, you watch when I disconnect the solar panel, I bet the battery voltage drops. Not as drastically quickly as I would have thought. Let's re reconnect it again. Strange, here's a bit of wind, so let's pedal at the same time. Anyway, that's it for now. I'll see you soon. Cheers.